are playing Fears to Fathom Norwood Hitchhike. This is a super scary game where we play as a girl named Holly who has her car break down. We have to ask for a ride at night and get in a stranger's car. And it is super crazy. This video has the biggest Lanky Box jump scare moment of all time. Justin gets so scared. You guys don't want to miss it. <laughs> oh man, Adam, I really hope someone gives us a ride. We need one just like the video game. Hey, check it out. There's a car over there. Oh, hey. oh nice. They stopped. Cool. We're finally going to get a ride. Awesome. All right, let's see who the driver is. Huh? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. playing Fears to Fathom Norwood Hitchhike. So guys, this is a crazy game where there's a bunch of episodes and everyone is based on a true story. So this is one about a Norwood Hitchhike. Let's check this out, guys. It's gonna be crazy. This is the game. Let's go right now, bro. What is this story gonna be about? Now, these are true stories and these are some of the scariest video games ever made in history. Let's go. Fears to Fathom, episode two, Norwood Hitchhike. Guys, we are so hyped. June 16th. Guys, this game is awesome. Let's go. Okay, now what is this, all right? We're gonna have to read the story, bro. This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. Oh, bro. I was a little bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help, even if just a little bit. It's gonna get creepy, guys. Let's see what happens. <sighs> Dust, dude. I was one of those people who loves gaming conventions. Oh, nice. I'd go to every convention I get the chance to, and sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents weren't always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives. So that means uh, they're going on like road trips to go to gaming conventions and their parents didn't like the idea of that. Nice. But a plane ticket would have been too expensive. Okay. This convention I was at went great, and it was now the day to drive back home. But when I set off, I soon realized the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over 12 hour drive. 12 hour drive, that's a long drive. Okay guys, let's get into the game. I think we're waking up, oh, we're waking up. Oh man, we're driving. Oh, it is a nice little, nice little drive though. Nice little uh, scenic drive. Why did we just stop in the middle of nowhere? All what? Right. Can we get out of the car? I think we have to. So guys, we're playing in the POV of the person who left the gaming convention. Now they're driving home. Wait, why Why would we get out here? Why would I ever do that? Maybe we ran out of gas? Oh, the car broke down. No, wait, no, no, it didn't. No, it didn't. No, it didn't. Oh, I can drive the car. I get it. I get it. That's why it stopped. <laughs> I was supposed nice. to keep driving. <laughs> Oh. I'm, I'm zooming, I'm zooming. Arr, in the rah, 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 and we got okay. a text from Aiden Williams. Maybe that's our buddy or something. Okay, guys, I'm gonna stop the car before I check the phone. I will not do both at the same time. That's dangerous. Let's go. What are they saying? Oh, okay, so there's our dad and uh, Aiden Williams. Let's see what our dad is saying. He says, you called? Yeah, I think I'm going to that convention. Can I get your car for like five days, please? With who? Aiden. Okay, so Aiden's our friend that we went to the convention with. Okay, so it all makes sense. That internet friend? He's a nice guy. No, you're not going on a 10 hour drive by yourself. Well, I've already made up my mind. I'll drive you. Why don't you understand anything? Let's talk when I get home. Drive safe, Holly. Don't forget okay. to call me. Okay, so our name's Holly and we're going to a gaming convention with Aiden and our dad does not like trust him. He, does, he said, you're not going on a 10 hour drive by yourself. Okay, so, but we ended up going, I guess. And he says, don't forget to call me, okay? You got it, dad. And then there's the contact information of the guy. Anything else? I'm leaving now. Drive safe, Holly. Okay, let's see what Aiden Williams says. Let's go to the top of this. Okay, what is this? Uh, we got tickets, so I'll see if I can get the car. Let you know, finally going to take Milo on a walk, lol. Air, oh. lol. Okay, the plan is on. Awesome. Wait, you're getting the car? Yup. Big girl. What? You sure Ash can't come? That's what Adam says when he gets milk. He says, big boy. That's what he says, bro. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll get the skateboard too. Saw this really cool skate park nearby. Sounds fun. Discord, where are you? Almost there. I don't see you. Peach shirt? Okay, so this must be their text messages when they were at the convention. They were like looking for each other. Okay, okay, let's see what he says. It was fun. I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Smiley face. Again, you sure driving all the way back? I don't really have a choice now, do I? Could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you reach back to your cave. Okay, Dad. 
Come Not on. sure if it'll be this lifetime though. What do you mean? Stuck in the biggest traffic jam of the country. That sucks. It's not too good here either. I think it's the people from the convention. That's it, I'm rerouting here. You gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, so everyone's just kind of talking. Um, they're just like, okay, so she's talking to her dad and Aiden Williams. Can we trust Aiden, bro? Always trust an Aiden. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I, I trust them, I trust them. I, it sounds like they're still at the convention that we left early. Yeah. Okay, so we're driving. <laughs> Yeah, don't Aiden, ever, Aiden sounds nice. Oh, our dad texted us. Don't ever drive like how I'm driving. I'm just a silly video game. I like to go. <laughs> but that would be very unsafe in real life. Okay, I'm zooming. I'm zooming. I'm zooming. Uh, nice. Okay, should I read the text from our dad? Let's read it. Where did you reach? Uh, where did you reach? What does that even mean? I'll admit I was a terrible driver. Still about six hours from the city. Got stuck in a jam. Oh, I was. Oh, oh see, oh. this is what. This is why you don't do what I just did, guys. Do not check the phone while the car is still running. See, I went off the road, bro. You will oof. Wait, I don't even know where I'm at. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, is this the road? See, this is what happens, guys. This is why you never do that, bro. There's the road. All right. I don't know which way is forward anymore, which is great. That's awesome. Oh, dear. That's really bad. See, guys, this is why. This is why. Always be careful, guys. Always be careful. Don't, don't do what I just did, bro. Stay focused. Yep, and always be lit. It's gotta be this way, right? It has to be this way. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's hope. If it's not this way, that'll be very embarrassing. Nice, let's go. Nice, cool. we're back on the road. See, you guys, don't check your phone in the car. Yep, life is a highway, guys. Yeah, life is a highway. I'm, I'm gonna drive it. My oh, way. Oh, yeah, yeah, let's go. This is lit. Oh, wait, I think the fuel thing just went on right there. Okay, see, I'm gonna park the car. Dad, stop texting me, bro, I'm busy. Told you to take that flight. Okay, why would he text that? Why would he just say told you so? Okay, I'm going the right way. <laughs> it does look like, guys, if you look really closely, you put an arrow on screen, there's that red light, and um, that means that we're low on gas, which is bad. That means we have to pull over somewhere. Oh, hopefully there's a gas station soon. <laughs> is that a person? What? Oh. Hey, yo, hey, that was a person, that was a person, there was a person there. Should we get out and talk to them? Oh, wait, it's a gas station. Yo, why were they walking off like that? Weird. All right, let's just get gas and dip. Sussy. Very sussy. Very sussy. Let me read the text from Dad. Oh, Holly, it's going to be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling all right. Okay, cool story, Dad. All right, let's go. Bro, what if I go over there and explore where they were? I'm Nah, nah. I'm just going to get gas and get out of here, bro. <gasps> well, no, this is just a gas station. This is normal. Yeah, this is totally normal, bro. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's all of our luggage and stuff. Uh-oh. Oops, I took it out on accident. I didn't mean to do that. Yeet. Nice. Okay, it's cool. We got a bunch of cool stuff. How do we uh, add gas? I'm not really sure how to do this. Maybe we go into the gas station and talk to the guy. I'm not used to this because Adam's mom has a Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, guys. I'm just kidding. She just doesn't allow us to like get out at the gas stations. We just have to sit there because she knows if we go inside, we'll get a bunch of snacks. Oh, look at all those snacks. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, they got some milk. Vegan milky? Is that what okay. it said? Should I talk to these people? Okay, mom is texting us. Should I talk to this guy? Hold on, let me talk to this guy. What's up, dude? How's your night going? Uh, so we can choose what we want to say. They're saying nothing. I'll say, how's your night going? Oh. He just looked at me. Sus. Hey, yo. Sus. Imagine walking up to someone being like, hey, how's it going? And they just look at you and then walk away. Let me talk to this guy. Hi, can I get $10 on pump two? Okay, yeah. Yes. Okay, cool. So we added we added some gas to the car. That's great. That's great. Thanks. Nice. You heading to the bridge by yourself? The uh, bridge. The bridge. Okay, yeah. The Norwood Valley Road, I mean. Not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Okay. Be careful. Okay, wait. What do you mean, be careful? Like, what, what is there to be careful of? What do you mean? For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there. Oh, uh, why? And people who went looking for them never returned. Well, why? Why? Locals say the Norwood Valley monster had torn them up and hung them upside down on trees. Was it like Bigfoot? <laughs> what is he talking about? Can we just use the toilet, please? You want to use the toilet, Adam? Let's just let's just get out of here, man. Let's I'm just gonna say thanks for the gas, bro. Thanks for the gas. I'm out of here. I'm not even gonna use the toilet. I'm out of here, bro. Oh, get some ice cream though. Oh, excuse you. Okay, so can I get some snacks? I cannot. But it looks fun in here. I'm not, I'm not using the bathroom, bro. The bathroom's sus, bro. I'm like, ah. And one more thing. What? 
If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. White or blue gown, okay. Just step on gas as hard as you can. Wait, why? Who, who is she? Some people say that she oofed in a car accident there on prom night. Some say that she seeks vengeance after she was murdered there. What, like a, like a ghost? <sighs> Regardless, she's out for blood. Okay, I don't like that. Whatever you do, never, ever, under any circumstance, pick up a hitchhiker. Those people out there on the road putting their thumbs out, they ain't what you think, ma'am. They just ain't. Okay, now the, the name of this chapter is Norwood Hitchhike, so I think there is gonna be a hitchhiker. Oh, what was that person doing near our car? Uh, why are they walking like that, too? Who are you? Excuse Should we me. go talk to them? A excuse oh! In a white van, too. They zoomed off, bro. They zoomed off. Now, guys, a hitchhiker? Um, Adam, explain exactly what a hitchhiker is. So a hitchhiker is someone that stands on the side of the road and they basically ask you for a ride. So it's a stranger that wants to get in your car. Uh, it's a little bit sus, guys. It's a little bit unsafe. Um, so we're gonna watch out for those. And then if anyone's asking for a ride, we just will keep driving and say no. I'm not sure why, but at first I went on without getting gas. I did get gas. What do you mean? Oh, I asked for. I gotta back it up. Beep beep beep. I gotta pump the gas. It's the game's not gonna let me keep going. Oh man. Oh, cause we paid for it, but we didn't pump it. Yeah, but I thought. Okay, I thought that was the same thing. Come on, man. Lame. All right, I gotta go back. No big deal. All just right, guys. Backing it up. Backing it up at one mile an hour, no problem. Through some trees, no big deal. I'll admit, I was a terrible driver. That's not true, I, I don't think that's true. Oh, uh, thanks. I'm I think really you're a good. great driver. I'm really good at driving, honestly. Yep. I'll Justin become, is as good as driving as Lightning McQueen. I'm gonna become a professional driver. I now have to do a several point turn to get myself out of this sticky situation. Yeah, that's true. Dude, who was that person who was walking in the woods earlier? You really didn't see them? Guys, there was someone in the trees. Like, there was definitely someone there. Yeah, we saw him. And who was that weird guy in the white van that was like, I don't know, checking out your car? Yeah, I don't like that, guys. All right, I had to do a big turn, a big U-turn to go and get some gas because I left without getting gas, which is kind of lame. My bad. That's okay. That's okay, I'm enjoying the ride. Life is a highway, dude, I'm going on a slow ride. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. <laughs> like, I'm, awesome. going on, I'm, I'm going on a slow ride, so it doesn't really matter. All right, how do I pump the gas? All right, take Give it easy. Give me the gas. Oh, on pump number two. Yeah, okay, there we go. We filled Sweet. up the gas, nice. Lit, guys, lit. Guys, so far, the game, this chapter, not too creepy. I filled the tank and I was off the road again. Since my mom asked, I had to buy something from Milo from the store. Oh, we didn't read the mom's text. I totally forgot. Okay, what is she saying? Holly? Mom? I don't know if you'll find any shop at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Could you get something from Milo? I'll pay you back. Bro, people are asking me to do chores at like 3 a.m.? All right, let's go get some dog food at the gas station. No big deal, okay? Aren't we like six hours away too? Like, it's gonna be, be a while. Yeah, well, it's dog food. Yo, back up! That guy looking sussy. Where's the dog food? That's, no, this is, what, this is what Adam would buy right there. That's what Adam would buy right there. One of those donuts? <laughs> no, it says... Do, do, do. <laughs> what? I don't get it. It's toilet paper, dude. I, I don't get it. Okay, well, that's what Adam would buy. Okay, um, that would be, be $5. dollars dollars Yes, I'll pay. Thank you. Nice. Yum. Kibble. Okay. What was the point of... Why, why would they make us buy that, though? Like, what's the point of that? Now I gotta, like, carry this to the car? Um, well, it's for when we get back home, our dog will have nice and uh, good food to eat. Okay, yeet. Uh, I gotta throw it in there. Yeet, there you go. Nice! This game's cool. Alright, nice. Nice. Alright, now I'm driving. Back to driving. Nothing life sus is, at all so far. Dude, life is a highway, and I'm gonna drive this car all the way home. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> oh, man. You know what? I'm gonna really focus on my driving, because I was driving badly. I'm trying to... Uh, right down the highway. Let's go. Alright, you got it, man. Okay. Being on the road, you do realize a thing. What's that? What's that, Holly? Monsters truly do exist. What? Why? How did you come to that realization? And every single one of them looks just like you and me. How? Why Why are they saying that? We haven't run into any monsters. Well, our mom's texting us. All right, I'm going to pull over and read. Okay. It's not expired or anything, right? Oh, no. We said surprisingly there was dog food at the gas station. You don't need to pay me for it. It's not expired. Why are they texting about dog? Oh, why did my lights go out? I knew, I knew I shouldn't have read that text from our mom. Why did my lights go out? Uh... Why do I, why do I... Oh, no, it's back, it's back. All right, nice. 
Why, why did my lights go out like that? I'm going, I'm zooming. Oh, I can't even see. Okay, let's go, dude. Let's All right, go. Remember, guys, we should not see anyone on the side of the road, and if we do, it's a really, really bad sign. Dude, this is lit. I'm a highway star. Oh, wait. What? Why is there a car in front of us? Especially if they have a blue or white gown what is that? on. Huh? Why is it flashing? Why is the car in front of us like... What is that? Uh, they're probably just someone else on the road. It's probably nothing. They're looking kind of sussy. Why are they just... Why are... Okay, so our lights were flashing. Our lights are, like, not working. Oh, no. Oh, no. Got it. Guys, I can't really see where I'm going because the lights are off. No oh, more no. headlights? I can't even see the car in front of me. I might... What if I run into it? As long as we just stay straight, we're all right. Guys, they really turned off the lights, bro. They really killed the lights. Oh, it's back. Am I, uh, am I supposed to press a button? Like, what is that? Not sure. I guess the lights, the lights are like flickering. They're on and off. We're like low on the battery. Yeah. Oh could, man, that's scary. Be. Yeah, that's scary guys. Because if the lights go out, you, 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 you cannot drive. You gotta stop. Yep. Super scary. That would be bad. Okay, so far I haven't seen anything creepy. I'm just driving a long way. You got it. <sighs> you got Dude. it, man. Let's go, dude. Let's go. I'm zooming. I'm going home. Oh, is this the bridge they were talking about? Uh-oh, sussy. <gasps> this is the bridge they were talking about. Sussy. Wait, people go missing here. Guys, this is some sus activity going on here. All right, as long as we just keep driving, we'll be all right. <laughs> sus. <laughs> this is a sus situation. <laughs> okay. Wait, this bridge is really long. Okay, now we're in like an abandoned part of town. I'm looking around. I don't see anything too sus right now. It's all good. We're, yeah. we're doing good. Dude, this is a cool driving simulator. Let's go. Oh, I thought those trees were people for a second. Yeah, me too. That was scary. Okay, we're good. Oh, now we're on like a dirt road. We're like off the main road. That's not good. <gasps> Why'd my lights go out again? Ooh. Oh, nice. They're back. Okay. <laughs> Yo, we're zooming through this dirt road. Let's go. You're good, man. You're doing great. We're doing very good, but it's I'm feeling a little bit scary. I'm a little scary. Let's just Guys, hope we, there's oh, no one. Oh, there's a car. There's a, there's a car right there. As long as we're just the only ones out here. As long as there's no people, oh, oh, we're good. It's a rabbit. Oh, rabbit. There's, a ra there's a rabbit. There's a rabbit. Watch out for animals, guys. Yeah. Dude, I'm zooming. I'm trying to get out of here. I do not like this. What is that? A house? There's a house up ahead. <gasps> Our lights. No. Okay. Oh, no. It's like a barn or something. It's like a bridge. It said no left turns back there. I wonder what happens if you turn left. There's this very weird thing about that night. No! I saw two big logs in the middle of the road blocking the way ahead. I have to get out. No! Ooh, sussy. Ooh, sussy. Ooh, sussy. It almost seemed as if someone had deliberately put them there. I didn't think much of it at the time. Oh, no. Oh, this is bad. What do I do? Move them? How many so move them? Oh, oh, those heavy. were heavy. So yeah, guys, someone put these here to make us get out of our car so that they might oof us. Somebody's gonna attack me. I don't like this. I don't like... Uh, move it faster, please! You got it, man. You got it. Be Wait, strong. This is Wait, this is... Somebody's gonna jump scare us, dude. Somebody... Uh, somebody... Oh, no. 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 Be oh, strong, no. dude. You I'm, can do I, it. I had to move the logs. I did. I did. You what? gotta move them more? Why are they moving back? Oh wait, I gotta like drag them. I didn't know that. I'm gonna get attacked. I'm gonna get, I don't like this. I really don't like this. <laughs> you got it, dude, you got it. I got that bad feeling like something's right behind me. Oh, bro, drive, 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 drive. Guys, this chapter is really scary. Drive! What if oh. the car's, the car's moved? The, car. oh. the car wouldn't start back up. <laughs> oh, no! This is terrible. This is a bad situation, bro. Oh no, what are the odds of that? Oh no. Oh no, I don't even know how to fix a car, bro. And just like that, I was stranded in the middle of nowhere with no phone service. Guys, this is a nightmare. This is a terrible situation. I'm not saying that I was starting to believe whatever this garbage that gas station clerk pulled, but I wouldn't be lying if I said I didn't feel slightest of unease. Uh, the slightest of unease, this is super bad. I don't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but this is bad. Throughout my life, I was told not to take rides from strangers. Yeah, that's good advice. 
But at that moment, I had no choice. So no. we're, we're going to hitchhike. No, we are not. We no, we are to. not. Why do I was scared to think how long it would take for someone to pass. Somebody's going to pull up. Nah. Why would you hitchhike? Just... Well, I guess you have no phone service. I guess there's nothing you can do. Oh, my goodness. 10.23 p.m. So scary. Couldn't you wait for someone to show up and then, like, borrow their phone, though, or something? Well, they said there's no self-service out here. So what, we're just gonna abandon our car here? Oh, no. I saw a car nearing. Should I hide? Should I hide? I'm hiding. No, we should go be like, hey, please help us. We're not... We're not a monster. I <gasps> left. Oh. Is the game over now? Pure evil. What does that mean? They didn't leave. Uh, I didn't understand how somebody could leave another human being stranded like that. Well, actually, I was hiding, so... <laughs> that was our bad. Oops. Uh, no, I, I didn't want... I don't want to... I don't want to... I don't want to go in... I don't want to go in the car. I'm scary. Only Teslas. 10.43 p.m. We only like the cars with the doors <laughs> like this. Justin will not get in any car if it's not a Tesla. <laughs> yes, I will. Yes, I will. What are you saying? <laughs> or Lightning McQueen. All right, yeah. here we go. <laughs> okay. Guys, I don't know if I was... Oh, there's another car. Uh-oh. Okay, fine. I'll wave this one down. Hello? All right, please Hello? stop. Please stop. Please stop. Hello? Use oh, a truck. Is that the truck from the gas station? What happens if we stand in front? We probably get oofed. Don't do that. <sighs> oh, somebody's getting out. Oh, no. If it's the gas station guy, we that's okay, because he was nice. No, it was the person that was at the gas station that was walking in the woods. Oh, no. Hello? What do I do? Go up and talk to them? Oh, no, bro. Dude, or imagine if that white van guy comes by. Guys, I don't like this. Oh, there's somebody in there. Oh, no. Yo, guys. This is never, ever, ever would this would would anyone do this in real life. This is bad. Yo, they're just sitting. There. Hello? Don't do this. <gasps> You're the girl from the gas station. Oh, that was the guy at the gas station who wouldn't talk to us. Uh, what should we say? Thanks so much for stopping. Didn't think anyone would stop for me. Yeah, let's just try and be nice. Thank you so much. What are you trying to do out here? I think, I think my, my car, car just broke down. Yeah, I think my car just broke down, bro. I can't call for help. There's no phone service. He says dot, dot, dot. You think I can get a ride? Nah. Where are you heading to? Just the nearest stop where I can call for help. Just, just like five feet up the road, dude. I just needed my phone to work. Okay. Hop in. Oh, we could just sit in the in the truck bed. That's a little bit safer. Thanks so much. Could you wait till I get my stuff? Hurry up. Just throw it in the back. I won't be here for too long. Oh, sus. As long as we just chill in the back there, like, I mean, we could just hop out if he gets sus. Uh, we're not going to sit in the back. He's not going to let us, probably. You can't sit in the back, Adam. There's no seatbelts. That's true. It would not be safe. What, I gotta carry all this stuff? Ugh. I gotta go back and forth, bro. Well, at least we got dog food. Man, this is not good. Okay. Lit. Man, he couldn't even back up the truck a little bit. You make me walk all the way back and forth? Come on, bro. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> What's that, skateboard? <laughs> Dude, who cares about the skateboard? Just leave it We're and then call for... Why don't we just leave it and call for help and then come back? Why are we going to do this? Uh, I don't know. In case we're not able to come back, like, we might as well take all our stuff. What? Yeah, in case we oof. True. Come on, bro. You can back it up a little bit, man. <laughs> all right, we got everything. We did it. All right. Man. I got a bad feeling, dude. Me too. Yeet. Okay. Everything's there. I gotta get in here. Oh yes, no, sir. I gotta talk to him. I gotta talk to him. I gotta talk to him. Alright, it's all in there. Hurry up. I need to get moving now. I'm oh, done. he could have helped he could have helped me, bro. Never mind, I'm done. Finally, now hop in, be quick. This guy's kinda mean, bro. I cannot hop in the back, I gotta hop in here. Oh no. <sighs> Sus! Oh sussy! Oh sussy! I don't feel too good about this, man. Super sus. <laughs> <laughs> this is so sus, man. I don't like this. So you won't tell me who you are. Where are you going? I'd uh, rather not say if that's okay. Or should I say I live really close from here or I was driving home? What should I say? Uh, let's just say I'd rather not say. Dude, that's sus. He's going to know. He's going to think we're keeping secrets. All right, sure. Adam said to do it. Let's go. If you say so. Okay. Oh, bro. Oh, bro. 
Oh, it's creepy. Okay, I mean, he's not being mean. We shouldn't judge him yet. Yeah, uh, he says, you're really lucky I had to be on this side of the town tonight. I mean, technically that's true, otherwise we'd be stranded. I must say, you are one brave young woman. Okay, how's, how's that? that? How's that? Or what's that supposed to mean? I'll say, what is that supposed to mean? Well, that's kind of mean if I say, what is that supposed to mean? I'll say, uh, how, how's that? What do you mean? You got any clue what happened to your car back there? Uh, I think it was an, a battery or an old car. I don't know. I think it was just an old car. I, I don't really know. That's it? I think so. <gasps> oh, wait. Maybe he's... Dude, I think I know what he's trying to say. I think that guy at the minivan, at the white van earlier, might have, like, sabotaged our car. That... Oh, he says, so what do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? Okay, he really creeped me out. Yeah, he's saying people went missing. Interesting. Dude, what if this is the guy that put the logs there? Idiot yeah. tells that to every person traveling down here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold up. The guy at the gas station said, look out for a woman wearing what? Uh, white or blue gown. And what is he wearing? A blue shirt with white with on it. Oh no. Oh no. Is he wearing her outfit? I don't Fit know, check. Dude. Drip check. <laughs> this is so <laughs> sus. <laughs> I'm gonna say, so is it true? What, the monster? Let's see, I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are, there are some things. And I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. That's what I'm saying. I think someone sabotaged our car. Hey, listen, I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. Okay, that made no sense. Thanks what is for that. that. What, what is that supposed to mean, buddy? All right, let me keep my, well, keep my one eye on the road and one eye on him, kind of like this. <laughs> okay. You know... <laughs> I can move my eyes in opposite directions, guys. That's what I just did. Okay. You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. Okay, that's cool. Hey, at least he apologized. That's cool. All right, cool. I keep one eye on him, one eye on the road like this. Dustin really hits the Pennywise sometimes. No, I can, I can read one page of a book with my left eye and the other page with the right eye. Okay, it is now 12.08 a.m. <laughs> It's about an hour away from 3 a.m. <laughs> After a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Okay, cool. Okay, okay, okay. Apparently, they offered roadside assistance. Okay, nice. So the guy helped us out. Okay, legit. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful. There are all kinds of people out there, he said ominously before leaving. Okay, I mean, he did help us, but I don't know if we could trust him. All right, see ya. All right, we got all of our stuff. Okay. Dude, how you need this many things for, like, just a weekend, like a convention? Oh, I don't know how long the convention was. Okay. Um, this is a little bit sus. What is that? Yo, is that a tow truck? Was that tow mater? All right, let me go here. <laughs> oh, what's up, dude? What's up, dude? What's up, dude? The man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Okay. Gal need a room to shack up for the night? How much is it for a room? Or, um, yes, I'm only going to be here a few hours. Oh, yeah, just a few hours, bro. Just a few hours. $40 for single. Okay. Pay cash only. Okay, you got it. All right. Room number nine, right over there. Okay, we got a room key. Um, so he's just waiting. I, I can tell him about the car because they have roadside assistance. That means they'll help us fix our car. Uh, talk about the car. $90, Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Dude, it would have been cheaper to just buy a plane ticket at this point. <laughs> Let's pay, yeah. All right, we gotta pay. We paid $40 for the room, $90 for this, for the dog food. We, we spent a bunch of money. Good, I'll let Tommy know. All right. And uh, one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. Okay. Yeah, guys, don't wake people up. Let people sleep. Right, sleep's important. There's no way I'm picking up all my stuff again. Later, can I get, oh, some snacks, yummy. Oh, what, you can buy stuff. Oh, wait, oh. it increases sprint speed. Wait, why would I need to sprint, though? We can buy a soda. Yeah, wait, how much money do I have? Not sure. Let's just grab one soda, though. Should I just buy the cheapest thing, or do they, like, make you do different levels of sprint? Um, probably different levels of sprint, but who knows. I'm, I'm gonna get a little bit of everything, bro. Let me go ahead, let me go ahead and get a chocolate. Let me go ahead and get a chocolate. Hey, yeah, hey, It's yeah. gonna be a good night. Let, 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 me, let, let, let me go ahead and get some potato chips. <laughs> let, me get some, let me get some potato chips. Oh, collect your item. Oh, wait, you gotta consume it right away? You can't keep it? All right, consume. 
Oh, you can only have one. Oh, bruh. Okay. That's all that right. Didn't, that does not make me sprint faster at all. No, we're good. Be quiet. He said to be quiet. Room Guys, number sometimes, nine. Sometimes this game can like track your microphone. So if, I feel like if I talk in real life, it might wake people up in the game. I'm not even kidding. Oh, okay. Our mom texts us. We got service again. Let me, let me get inside first before it gets sussy. Mark. Get inside first. Nice. Oh. It was nice and warm inside. Dude, I don't trust... Dude, what's in here? <gasps> Except there was a smell. A type of musky smell you get from old houses. I can't open this door. Is someone in there? Why does oh, the you bed can... not have a mattress Shh. on it? Oh. oh, you can hide in here! <gasps> and look guys, it's reading Justin's microphone. SUS! <laughs> Why would I need to hide in there? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, wait, they're not attacking me. Maybe I should talk to them? Yo, who are you? Uh, uh, yo, what are you doing? Who, who are you? What are you doing uh, here? Dude, you scared me, dude. What are you doing? He, 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 he. He said, he said, he, he, he. Are you serious? He hit us with the he, he, he. Who are you? I'm Tommy, room service here at Roadway Inn, the finest stopover in Norwood. What were you doing in there? You know, uh, cleaning stuff. You are a liar. Guy at the front desk gave me this room. Get out of here. <laughs> you said, hee 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 That's what Adam says, bro. I'm gonna have to ask you to step outside while I make the room. I'll just go and get my stuff. Dude, what? Uh, get out of there. And why is he kind of like swagging on us? Look, hey, yo. He is a grown man swagging and giggling on you, man. Ah, <sighs> that is what Adam does, though. Uh, he does nope. That. Oh. Do you trust this guy? No. Hey, yo. Sheesh. <laughs> what? Looks like Mr. Potato Head. It looks like, man, this is how Adam thinks he looks, man. <laughs> when Adam works out and he look, he goes in front of the mirror and smiles like that. He, just, he thinks he's like this, bro. Uh-huh. Oh, you know no. me? I'm out of here, dude. <laughs> that was so creepy. Wait, there's not even a mattress. What, what, is, what, what kind of hotel is this, man? <laughs> Oh boy, I couldn't have slept there. What kind of hotel is this, man? Oh, we, at least we got like cartoons or something we can watch. All right, let me go get my stuff. That was insane. Oh wait, oh wait, our mom did text us. Let me let me read our mom's text, okay. What is this? Oh, dad, okay, this is, we couldn't send text. We got no service, okay. Aiden Williams says, hey, where are you at? Your dad's calling me. Oh, our dad was worried and called him, but we got no service. Our mom says, Holly, I can't text anyone. I got no service. Hmm, we're all right. Sus. Let me get some more snacks. I need to, I need to stress eat right now. True. Let me just stress eat right now. Let me get the most expensive thing they have. Why not? Most expensive thing I think is soda. Three dollars. Yeah. 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 I think you're right. Might make it run super fast. Buy that. Let's go. Let's go. Let's Ooh. go. That looks yummy. It's still gonna be a good night, guys. It started off a little rough. We don't have a mattress, and there was a weird guy in our bathroom, but it's all right because we got soda. That was so sus, bro. Don't tell me I gotta, I gotta carry everything again, dude. Come on, really? I think this is really fun. It is fun, but I don't know why they make you do this. <laughs> it's kind of fun though. This game is awesome. Dude, get out of my room. Get out of oh. my room. Oh, 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 we have a mattress now. Oh, maybe he was putting it there. Hopefully. I'm, I got my eye on you. What, what are you doing, bro? I had a word with Joe about the situation. You mean the mattress situation? What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. What, what is he talking about? Oh, you, okay, so they probably told him about the car and his response is what's wrong with these people. So I think someone sabotaged our car. Yeah, I mean, I don't think those logs just fell there, but don't you worry, it's safe here. I go get your car. Okay. And also the room's phone is not working. If need anything, just ask at the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. Hee <laughs> hee. But you have a good night. <laughs> Yo, and he walks like Adam too. Yup, that's definitely my goal. Okay, wait, so if we go to the front desk, they said we could use their phone, which is my, we can call our mom and dad and let them know what's going on. Oh, all right, cool. That's useful, right? Like that's gotta be useful. Yeah, super useful. Then go ahead and let me just go ahead and borrow that phone real quick, buddy. Where's the phone? Where's the phone? Let me, where's the phone, bro? 
Right over there, room number nine it is. No, I, I need to use the phone, buddy. I see it, let me use it. Let me use the phone, I see it, it's right there. Bring Lame. Bring. Lame, okay, so we can't use the phone, which normally we would, because if you if we could use the phone, we could call our parents and let them know what's going on. Hmm, so we still don't have service out here? No, we got no service. Yikes. We're in the middle of nowhere. We are literally just stranded. Well, we got soda and dog food, so we're, we're chilling. Bro, I cannot believe that guy jump scared us so badly. That was insane. Let me make sure he's all good. You out of there now? All right. Don't. You gotta check all the corners, make sure it's all clear. Yep. Okay. <sighs> this game, I'm getting a little bit nervous. I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting a little bit nervous. Me too. But we love this game, guys. Keep watching. You will get to see the ending of this game in this video. This game is super awesome. It's very creative. There's a bunch of cool stuff that goes on all the time. You're right. Okay, let's go. Go back. Okay, this is our last of our luggage. Nice. Sweet. Bro. It's really building up the suspense. Now I know why they make us carry stuff. It builds up the suspense. All right, nice. Is there I someone there now? Through. You can't get through here, so I need to remember that. In case I need to run from something later, I need to like, go this way. I wonder why they would do that. That's weird. Only had two hands. Yeah, I know. Okay. Okay now, okay, now we just chill, right? Lock the door. Unless there's somebody in here. Ah! No. Okay, we're good. Okay, we're nice. good. Let me just go ahead and hide in the closet until... Oh. Check our text. Holly? Why did it just open on its own? Because we walked out. Okay, what do I do now? Now maybe I'll go to the front desk and ask for the phone? Hmm, probably, yeah. Let me go and ask for the phone. That's so sus. This whole thing is so creepy. I think someone put the logs there on purpose and I think someone sabotaged our car. You're right. I need a stress eat. I need a balanced meal. I had soda, I had chocolate. It's time for some potato chips. Sus, 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 sus. Where's the potato chips? Someone bought them? Oh, nachos, yummy. Oh, chips, buy that. <laughs> 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 yummy, we got a balanced meal here. Let's go. Awesome. Nice. Get that, consume. Nice. Okay. Let's go see if we can use that phone. Oh, dude, I feel like we could just chill here for like a few hours, like safer here, you know? You have a great night's sleep. That's it? That's all he's gonna say? Oh, so, oh, so we just go to sleep. All right, and then hopefully it'll be the morning. Hopefully it'll be nice and chill and we'll get to go home and feed our dog and hang out with our parents and it'll be all good. I mean, I feel pretty safe just cause there's a lot of people here. Like there's someone just working right there, you know, like. I feel okay. Yeah, nothing unless creepy's it, gonna happen. Unless there's somebody in our room already. Don't, don't, don't. Okay, check this corner again. Okay, we're good. That sometimes the animal, sometimes the animal do that. We play hide and seek, he hides like behind the door like that. He'll hide like right there. Yeah, Justin knows all the best hiding spots. Yes, sir. All right, let's go to sleep. Nice, okay. Nice. Oh. Are we dozing oh. off? I can't see anything. Because the luggage is in the way. Is there someone there at the door? <gasps> Wish. It sounds like something's flushing. What? Get up. Get up. <gasps> oh! Ayo! Ayo! Call it a foresight, but there was something very off about that place. Get up, get up, get up! I hate that feeling. I couldn't help shake the feeling that something wasn't right. Somebody used our toilet! <clears throat> the feeling tiredness was overcoming by anxiety. What do I do? A hot cup of coffee could help, I thought to myself. Oh, we order coffee? I think we have to go and get it at the outside. Or, can I use this? <clears throat> oh, no. the phone's, the phone's oofed. <gasps> Guys, someone was peeking through our window. Somebody was just standing. Wait, but we have curtains. How would they even see us? Oh no. Where do I get coffee? Probably from here. The vending machine, right? Oh, that's not gonna be hot. Maybe they have a coffee machine right next to it. Let me go and ask them. Hey, you guys have coffee? Adam wants a frappuccino. You have a great night's sleep. I guess not. I guess we're just gonna have some coffee and stay up. Okay. 
Let me go ahead and get some coffee. Is there coffee in here? No. Energy soda? That's not the same <clears throat> thing. Hmm. Dude, where do I get coffee? Or maybe I make it in my room? We could try. Um... Let me let me let me just have an energy drink and see if that works. Okay. Energy soda. Bye. Dude, this is super sus. I I, I do not know who that was earlier, but that kind of scared me. Why were they watching us sleep, dude? I don't know. I don't like it. Well, it's okay. Let's go. Let's go get some coffee. Yeah, we're good. Where did I get that though? The energy soda makes you run way faster. Jeez. Nice. Something's wrong. Feels kind of sus in here. <laughs> okay. Wait, where do I get coffee? Can we just I go back to sleep? Maybe. Can I close these? Who was there? Didn't want to sleep. Only coffee would help me stay up. Where am I going to get coffee? Try to find out. Where do I get coffee? Is there like a diner? Maybe... Maybe there's coffee around here. They should have coffee here, right? Can you give me some coffee, sir? Dude! Where is it? I'm gonna try looking. Did I miss something? Oh, um, check by the other doors. So if you go to door number four, there's an espresso machine. Oh, why would they put it outside? There oh, it there is. it is. There's. Nice. Somebody's gonna jump scare me from door number four. Which one do you want, Adam? Uh, give me the espresso. Why that? Okay, nice. Making oh. coffee, in a, coffee in a vending machine? I've never heard of that before. Must be really fancy. Yeah. And our coffee, I'm going back to my room. Oh. Do you feel okay? Wait, why Why did the screen just go dark? What is this? What is going on? What, hey, yo, what is going on? Do we get poisoned? Oh, no! Wait, guys, all the controls are like backwards. I can't move. There was poison what? in there. Somebody's talking to me. Somebody's cooking. I can't, guys, I can't move. The controls are like all backwards. When I push forwards, it goes backwards. That is really creepy. What, what just happened? Let's just head back to our room and go to bed. I don't know which one our room is. It must be this one. Uh oh. Dad, oh. dad, dad. Dad, what did he say? Dude, what happened? What is that? What's wrong with the coffee? I can't get in there. Oh, remember, we have to go to the right? Dude, I can't move. It's like so, everything's backwards, guys. Like if I look up, it looks down. Oh, this is terrible. Somebody's gonna jump out of roommate. Stop, 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 stop. I can't, I can't we, go this way. Should we just read our dad's text? I can't, I can't read anything. Oh, oh, it's blurry. This is terrifying. Guys, this is awful. I can't see anything, I have to go around. Somebody's gonna jump out of door eight. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Oh no! Oh. oh my goodness. I cannot control myself right now. Do we have to do that again? Dude! We like drifted off the path. Dude! Guys, we're gonna make it back to our room, don't worry. I can't, I can't move. We got poisoned. Who would poison us though? You think it's the front desk guy? I don't know. Or the guy that was in our room, the creepy guy? I don't know, there's gonna be someone in our room. I'm terrified. Why did the door just open by itself? Bedtime. There's somebody in the in the bathroom, bro. Please no. <gasps> no, 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 no. I'm I'm gonna hide. I'm gonna hide. I can't even see. Oh. <gasps> oh. I can't see anything. This is bad. I'm gonna go to sleep. Yeah, I feel let's just terrible. let's just go to bed. Yo, that was crazy. I couldn't control it, guys. Like everything was backwards. Let's see what time it is, guys. That was a crazy part of the game. Super sus. You think they put poison in there? 3.18 a.m. It's 3 a.m. Not, not 3 a.m. I was sedated. What does that mean? 
It's like when you get poisoned, guys. I was poisoned. The phone's ringing. The phone's ringing. Get up. Oh, no. Get up. Why is all of our stuff on the ground? There's no one there. There's someone in there. There's someone in there. In the someone bathroom? In there. There's someone in the bathroom, I'm sure. You wanna hide? Yeah. <laughs> oh, lame. <laughs> oh, lame. Well, I, th I thought you said, Justin, that you don't get scared and that you're uh, not a baby. Oh, lame. Dude, that was, okay. Biggest jumps in landing box history right there. I literally jumped like <laughs> six feet in the air. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. Bro. Oh bro. lame. Huh? Oh <laughs> lame. Bro, lame. <laughs> I literally, I literally, guys, I jumped that high when I played basketball. I literally jumped nine feet in the air right there. Oh my goodness, my head hurts. All right, guys, that was super crazy. Okay, we're back to where we were with the inverted part. I'm gonna go to sleep and guys, we're gonna figure this out. I don't think that jump scare was the end of the game, but that was insane. That was literally the biggest jump scare in Lanky Box history. I'm not kidding. Oh boy, okay, so there was someone hiding in our closet the whole time? That is so disturbing. Yeah, I'm going to bed, I'm going to bed. That is, well, not, not the whole time. I think right here when we go to sleep, they like sneak into our room, which is insane. Ew, I hate that feeling. That is crazy. Boxy said, Daddy, not lit. Ghosty says, <laughs> Boxy is so stressed out right now, bro. Boxy's shaking. Okay. I was sedated. Okay, so this time let's not go in the closet. Let's just kind of chill. I just chill? Can I well, can I leave? Should I leave the room? You can try, yeah. This is so sus. This is so crazy knowing that there's someone like in there. Ugh, yeah, let's try going outside. Let's just leave. Did I just crouch? Sure. So crazy is someone in there? I'm out of here. Didn't feel safe going out. Well, I don't feel safe staying in here knowing what I know. Huh. Let's just hang out here. Is there anyone like outside? No, I'm looking. Can I leave, please? There's someone in my closet. Uh. I can't leave. I'm gonna chill. This. I'm just gonna chill. I'm gonna chill. Oh. What? Oh, I'm checking the window. Wait, what? She went to sleep again? And we can't get up? No. Oh, wait, I can. Wait! Someone's coming! Oh, no. Wait, who's that? That's the manager. That's the manager. Hello? Hello? <gasps> Who is it? Front Don't desk. Open, open front the door. desk. Yeah, I'll, I'll open the door. It's safer than whoever's in there. What if I open the closet now? I probably still oof. What's up, dude? Didn't I specifically tell you not to wake anyone up? I didn't wake anyone up. What are you talking about? Well, I got jump scared. That was not my fault. I have complaints. What are you making all those goofy noises for? What goofy noises? Whatever it is, just keep it down, miss. I'm not making noises. Is that why your eyes are all red? No, they said, why are your eyes all red? I, I'm going to tell about the coffee machine. Are you messing with me? No, I'm not messing with you. We don't have no coffee machine here. What? It's right over there. Okay, okay, here. I've had enough of your crazy goons. For once, I thought we had a nice guest, but I guess I'm the crazy one here. Follow me. I hate my job. I'll show you. Follow me. I'll show you this coffee machine. I'm yeah. not crazy. And it's going to be missing, of course. Justin Dude, knows what he's talking about. That is so creepy. Someone put the coffee machine there and they hid it after. Which makes sense, because it has poison in the coffee. Wait, dude, can we trust this guy? He's walking so slow, he's walking so sus. Hey, pick up the pace, man. Pick up the pace, wait, what is that? There's nothing here. Nothing here anymore. Now I just look crazy. Oh no. But, I, but I'm not crazy. There was a coffee machine. Go back to the room. No, I, I promise, it was right here. Yo, back up, buddy. Wait, I, I promise it was right here. I said go back, now. Oh my goodness. And there's still somebody in our closet. Ugh. There should be some medication in your room that should offer you some relief. Check the table by the TV. Bro. We should not take that. Well, I don't, well, I feel like we can trust him because we already know someone else is hiding in our room. They're gonna give us some like 
I don't know, cursed vitamins or something. Dude, I mean, I don't know. I don't know who to trust anymore. This game is insane. And it's just so dark. There's still someone in our closet. <laughs> oh wait, is the closet open? We crouch? What was in this? Closet's open. Ugh. There's no, there's no medicine. Oh yeah, it's right here. Okay, I'm just gonna, I guess we have to continue the game. Okay? Okay, we got some vitamins here. Requires water. Awesome. <gasps> we gotta go oh. to our bathroom then? Oh no, I wanna go buy some at the, the machine. Dude, if someone jump scares me from the closet again, I'm done. <laughs> you quit? Yeah. Sus. Sussy. Sussy! Oh. Is there someone in our closet, dude? Like, actually? Close that. Close that. There's no faucet. What am I supposed to do? Uh, no, well, no, not no. that water. What? No. There's somebody in our closet, bro. Oh. Dude, the faucet's right there. I'm gonna get oofed. Should I check the closet, bro? Should I check it? No, I don't think so. Uh, I really don't think so. Okay, water time. Ah! Okay, because the guy's right next to us. Okay. Okay, they took the medic they took the medicine or the vitamins or whatever. I don't trust those pills though. I don't trust this closet though. I'm going to sleep. Go back to bed. Shall I, you want to check outside first? Okay. I went to sleep. Oh, I can't move. Oh, no. Wait, Were no, you I can poisoned get again? Okay, wait, should I go to sleep? Should I check outside? What should I do? I, Let's I check can't outside. get up. Sussy, 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 sussy. Guys, this is awful. Because, oh, what was that? Wait, uh, what was that? Someone just take a photograph of us? In 4K? Someone took a selfie? Should we go, like, out the door? Dude, there's a flash of light. Someone just took a photo of us. Don't feel safe going out. Oh, no. We just, uh, lose some time. <gasps> Who's that? He's back. Who's that? Who's that? The front someone desk guy? Someone, no, it's someone else. Hello? Didn't feel safe, but why are they right outside of our door? Uh. Did I hide? Uh. What should I do? Uh. Talking. Go up to the door. They're just saying hello over and over, real creepy. I think you can talk to him. What do you want, dude? Hello. Who is it? Please open the door, I need help. What do you want? I need your help. Please, please, please open the door. No! L wh what do we do, man? Um... I'm gonna do nothing. I'm not gonna open the door. Who are you? You sure we shouldn't? What should we do? Give you one sec. <gasps> they say I know you're in there. Hey, yo! Uh. Should, I, I'm gonna go, should I go in the closet? I'm gonna get jump scared. Alright, whatever. Whatever. <laughs> He's just knocking. I'll go talk to him again. Don't open the door. Please leave. I just need to talk to you. I swear I'm not a cop. Please, please go, go away. away. Oh, please go away. I'm going to call the police. Pretty lady. <gasps> oh, shh.
Oh, I think the manager saved us. To this day, I find it really weird that the manager inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected Motel's reputation and let go of the situation. Okay, so the manager there, he like hid there and he punched the guy, but he's telling us to not tell the police. I believe that the town could have been home to bad people or possibly something even worse. What? Tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year. I never went on long road trips again. I would always take airplanes. Bro. <sighs> That was terrifying, guys. We beat the game! Yeah!